all of the following are properties of ozone. Which of the following properties of ozone is a chemical property? So we have uh, four different choices, and uh, we'll go through in a short while and see which one is the answer. But before we do that, we have to go over the chemical property and physical properties. Okay, so let's uh, see the differences. First, chemical properties. So chemical properties that describe how substances react or change to form different substances. In other words, there must be chemical reactions involved. Okay, for example, wood or paper burns. That's an oxidation reaction, all right? Nail, I say the iron nails, they rust. That's also a chemical reaction. Um, bananas spoil. That's decomposition of bananas. You see, those are the chemical properties. The key concept here is there are chemical reactions involved. Then that will be the chemical properties. Now, physical properties, there are no chemical reactions involved. Again, that's a key concept, okay? So physical properties can be measured without changing the basic identity. Without changing the basic identity of the substance means no chemical reaction going on. For example, the color of your T-shirt, whether it's red or yellow, that's a physical property. Density of water is about one gram per milliliter. So that's no chemical reaction going on. It's just a physical property. Odor, melting point, boiling point, and so on and so forth. Those are physical properties. Okay, now let's go back to look at the four different choices. Okay, ozone is a Blue has a bluish color. Okay, bluish color is just a color, just like your t-shirt, just like your pants. Okay, so there's no chemical reaction going on. This is just a uh, physical property. So, physical properties. Okay. Uh, pungent odor. Yeah, it's how it smells. It's just a physical property, no chemical reaction involved. So again, that's a PP. Now, ozone decomposes upon exposure to light. Okay, if I write this statement or description in chemistry language, ozone exposes to light. You know light is energy. Then, actually, a chemical reaction going on, you see ozone O3 decomposes or degrades into oxygen molecule and oxygen atom. There is a chemical reaction right here. So therefore, this one has to be a chemical property, OK? D. Gas at room temperature. Just simply talk about that the physical state of ozone. Ozone at room temperature is just a gas, so therefore that's a physical property. And now obvious the correct answer for this question is C. Okay. And here I have an example of a banana spoil. Okay. If you want to learn a little bit more about that, the chemical reactions going on in this uh, uh, spoiling bananas process, so you can read here to uh, uh, 
better understand uh, what's going on with uh, uh, Bernardus boiling, so those chemical reactions.